I don't know what this country's coming to. Alec, you know, if we had our way, we'd have strung that kid up long ago. Oh, I guess Miss Joanne's talk had something to do with it. that putting that young outlaw behind the bars at Carson City for 20 years would break up this gang of road agents. Now we've got to round up the whole bunch and put them where he is. It's too bad. He's such a boy. That's why it's too bad they didn't give him life. I tell you, Miss Joanne, the longer he's locked up, the less trouble we'll have. We should have hung that kid. Aren't you satisfied taking 20 years off his life? I might be if it wasn't for you taking such a shine to him. Only I wouldn't be so proud of it, if I were you. I'm sorry for him. I don't suppose you could understand that. Sorry he can't sell you something he stole for a kiss? Is that what you think of me? You know what I think of you, Joanne. But you ain't been acting lately like you cared much. I never could care for you that way, Alec. You didn't say that before you met him. Did he change your mind? You've changed my mind. I can't respect anyone who'd kick a man when he's down. Undersigned citizens of Rattlesnake Gulch do herewith and hereby petition the legislature of this great state of Nevada to appoint Rattlesnake Gulch the seat of this county. Three cheers for his honor, the mayor. <laughs> Fellow citizens of this, this great, this great and glorious county, I want every man and woman, our Sam and our Singh, that includes you too, to step up and sign this petition. And if your friends and relatives ain't here, why, uh, you can sign for them too. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Glad to see anyone from Rattlesnake Gulch. 
And my old friend, the mayor. How is he? Well, to tell you the truth, Governor, he was, he was on his way to see you himself when he was suddenly uh, attacked. No. Yes, I was right there when it happened. He almost had heart failure. Well, a man's got to be mighty careful these days if he wants to live to a ripe old age. Well, his honor, the mayor, is going to be a heap more careful in the future. Well, sir, here you are, Governor. And I reckon every citizen of Rattlesnake Gulch has got his name on that petition. Yes, sir. And Chinaman, too. Whereas, uh... Therefore, be it resolved that we, the undersigned citizens of Rattlesnake Gulch, do herewith and hereby beseech the governor of this great state of Nevada to grant the said Buck Hurley, known as the Nevada Kid, a full and complete pardon. That's the way his friends feel about it, Governor. Do you know what I call this, sir? Well, I ain't exactly sure. It's the true Christian spirit. Mr. Williams, you should feel honored to represent Rattlesnake Gulch on such a mission as this. Then you will pardon him? You can tell all my old friends and uh, <clears throat> constituents that I will give it due consideration. In fact, uh, in fact, the pardon is granted right now. Thank you, Governor. And I promise you that the citizens of Rattlesnake Gulch will give you the surprise of your life next election. Oh, yes, of course, of course. <laughs> Well, I hope to have the pleasure of meeting you again soon, Mr. Uh, Sherry, uh, uh, Williams. Williams. Oh, yeah. Maybe you will, Governor. Yeah. Yes, sir. <laughs> you never can tell where you're going to run across me. No. <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> in fact, that's what they all say about me and Rattlesnake Gulch. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. <laughs> 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 Hey, you! Wait a minute. Uh, I, I, I can't, can't wait. I, I'm in a hurry, hurry, hurry. I'm glad I bumped into you. You're one of the first people I wanted to square things with. You and the mayor and that girl. <laughs> Don't shoot, kid. You wouldn't shoot without uh, giving me a chance. Nevada kid, Nevada kid. Charlie, 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 Weren't you expecting me? You don't think I'd let you and the others do that for me without coming back, do you? I don't understand. Where did you come from? By well, the penitentiary. Oh, broke out, did you? Well, you'll soon be on your way back. What? Wait a minute, Hank. You're not going after Malone. He, he, he'll, he'll kill you, sure. Now, don't get excited. Leave that to me. We better get him before he gets us. Don't draw, kid, or you'll be plugged before you reach it. Up with him. Sure had your nerve coming back to this town, kid. I reckon a fellow who busted jail... But he didn't. The governor pardoned him. What are you talking about, Joanne? Here's a pardon, all right, Charlie. The funny part of it is, he says the people of Rattlesnake Gulch signed a petition asking the governor to write it. What? I'll sign one to hang him. Only petition anybody here signed was about the county seat. But that petition was stolen from me by his gang. Now I see it. They changed that petition. Stealing my wallet wasn't enough for him. 
They had to steal the whole county seat. Let me see it. Well, a pardon's a pardon. He locked it. You're not going to let him get away with this. Don't see much we can do about it, Alec. We've been content with the law of the rest of them now. What he needs is the news. That's brave talk for you got the drop on me. Just a minute. Put up the gun, Alec. And you be mighty careful what use you make of your gun after this. It, because the next time... There won't be any next time. The governor won't be sorry about what he's done for me because I'm starting with a clean slate and it's going to stay clean. And as soon as I can get myself a job here... Who'd give you a job? Do we look crazy? Pardon or no pardon. This town ain't healthy for you, young fella, and you better clear out. But he means it. And so do I. That's straight talk, Charlie. That's your right. I'll be back, Miss Joanne. You'd cheat if you were playing solitaire. Fatted calf has returned, you maverick. Put on the bacon for the prodigal. Kid, you old buzzard. Rosita. I'm so happy you've come home. That face is with me, Chiquita. The Cherokee sees it that way. Ah, oh, go on. Give her another smack. Hiya, Buck. Fine, Slade. Glad you're back. Thanks, Kip. Glad to be here. You know, you've been like you lost a brother since you was away. Yeah? Come on, take the load off your feet. I don't know how to say it, Cherokee, about what you did for me. But you know what I mean. Ah, forget it. You don't think I'd let him poison you with that prison grub after being used to Rosita's cooking? Tamales. How I miss them. Ah, uh, not as much as we missed you, though. And I thought that petition was on the square. What a boob I was. <laughs> That's what I thought when you let that dame on the stagecoach make a chump out of you in the first place. Women are bad medicine for a youngster. I guess that medicine cured you all right. Of a lot of things, Cherokee. Why, the laugh's on the governor. We've saved your split for you out of every job since you've been away. I can't take it this time. Sure you can. You don't think we'd hold out on a partner. But you don't understand, Cherokee. I've got to be a different sort of a partner from now on. Ah, uh, you're good enough for me the way you are. But things are getting too hot. Now, there's a big shipment of gold dust coming from... Wait a minute. Now, wait till I get through talking. We're going to pull up and take the trail to California. 
And when we get to new territory... You've got to listen to me, Cherokee. And take it easy while I'm telling you. From now on, you can count me out. A fella does a lot of thinking up there in the pen, and I promised myself when I got out, I was calling it quits. I think the poor hombre means it. Any objections, Slade? Not if you're yellow. It doesn't take much courage to rob women, folks. She did make a chump out of you. And what kind of a chump do you think you're making out of me? Your pardon, sure. No sheriffs or neckties looking for you. But I took chances getting you out of that hole. And what do I get for it? Oh, I guess it's all right. Partner. I know that you gave me a chance to be different. And I'm not forgetting that. But nothing has to come between you and me, Cherokee. No. You understand, don't you, Rosita? It's sure tough, leaving here with you feeling the way you do, Cherokee. You pick your trail, follow it. Tell you, it is no good that we have the fellow, uh, what you call the Nevada kid, looking for a job in this town. Hmm. Let him look for a job. He won't find any. I'll take care of that myself. It, 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 it's a sh 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 shame that, 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 a, that a nice gal like m m m Miss, Miss, Miss jo jo Joanne uh, has to f f f feel sorry for the, the desperate character like him. Uh, uh, he better not let me catch him hanging around her. You know, he's got everybody else buffalo. They're scared to run him out of town. Well, I'll do it myself. All right, that's enough of that. Oh, excuse, please. It is a terrible thing that has happened. This Nevada kid, he cuts his throat for my customer. If, 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 if he ain't done it, he's sure going to before he finishes sh 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 shaving the <laughs> alley. Come on, Glennon. Come on, Frenchy, come on. That razor sharp enough. And make it a close shave. You have no idea how close he's going to be this time. So rough, Frenchie. Did I hear you say you were going to run me out of town? Well, I was only fooling, kid. 
Just like you were fooled about catching me hanging around Miss Joanne, eh? Sure, kid. I'll bet you wish I'd gotten any other job but this one. Sure, kid, sure. Next, gentlemen. She got yourself a job, kid. She's no job, but she's got. Get out! Wait till I get my pay. Two bits for a close shave like that? Come on. Come on. There you are, boss. Merci, monsieur. Maybe she's good business who keeps his job. It'd be a better idea for you to get out of Rattlesnake Gulch before you run out. By you? Wait a minute, Alec. Well, it knows of a better idea than that. It depends on just how much on the level you are with this reform talk of yours. Of course, there are safer jobs than riding with my stages as guard, but... Shooting ought to be in your line. Are you crazy? Just a minute, Alec. What about it, kid? I'll have to think it over. It isn't exactly the kind of a job I was hankering for. I'll let you know. If I didn't know you were in your right mind... Tell it to Hank. It's his idea. Well, if he's on a square, he has his chance to prove it. Mr. Brennan spoke to you? I told him I'd think it over. But you said you had thought it over all the time you were in prison, and that you had made up your mind. It's not so easy for me to make up my mind about this. I know, but that's why they offered it to you. They want to find out if you're as sincere as... As I know you to be. Thanks, Miss Joanne. But aren't you afraid you're taking a pretty long chance on a fellow like me? It's the long chance, isn't it? That pays the best odds? If it wins? I'm sure it will. If it means anything to you. Gonna be a stage guard, eh? Guess I wasn't far wrong. I told you you were a sucker. If you'd listen to me, he'd still be where he was. Yeah, I wish I had. You're making it tough on me, Cherokee. Why don't you quit it, like I did? You're not in so deep that you can't get out now. You'd like me to, wouldn't you? More than anything else on Earth. So you might be on Earth longer yourself, eh? That is, if there's nobody following that stage you're going to be riding with. I hoped you wouldn't force it to that. I want to be square with you, Cherokee. That's why I came back here. But I've got to be square with myself, too. If it's my job to protect that stage, Coach, I'm going to do it. Even if it means... Then you better shoot straight and fast. Is that all you've got to say? There won't be no need for any more words when you see me coming. Ooh. Ooh. Before you start shooting men in the back, Slade, you had better practice your draw a bit. Thank <laughs> you. 
Show me the gist. Horses are ready. Let's drift. We ain't going. The double crossing kid wouldn't stop me. You'd cut your own mother's throat, wouldn't you, Slade? Where do you get off to tell us where to go? I'm running this outfit. Well, we don't like the way you're running it. And we're going to see this through without you. How about it, Chip? That's right. Oh, I don't blame you. I guess I'm a sucker at that. No, no. You don't go away. Well, looks like a two-way split. Come on. Sometimes I think I'm right. It's mala suerte. Muy mala suerte. Right here, I'm hiding ahead. Looking for trouble, ain't you? If I find it, you'll know soon enough. Better get him to a doctor. I'm going after him. I guess they'll be waiting for you with your share. What are you driving at? I'll leave that to the others when I tell them where you went. If you got any accusing to do, you'll do it while I'm listening. So I'm going with you. All right. When he told me to wait, I knew there was something wrong. And then he wanted to follow them. Well, that's enough proof, Mr. Brown, that he's in with them. We, 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 we ought to string him up. That's what. We ought to do that first when he come back with a pardon. How's Miller, Hank? Cashed in, boys. But you don't believe that. Of I... course not. I know it's unfair of the others, but how can anything change their minds now? Old man Miller's dead, Joanne. I know what the rest of them think, Mr. Brennan. But you don't believe that I... Why don't you stop him? We'll trail him and drop the rest of them too. Come on, Bill. Fix. All right. On the horses. Let's go. Hey, all right, come on. Let's keep it. 
Follow me, boys. Don't leave Rosita. I'll send for you, Chiquita. As soon as I know where I'm going to be. You're not going anywhere, Cherokee. Not until you hand over that express company's money. Then you better get going fast. They're after you for murder. No, no. He was not with them when they robbed the stage. I was a chump not to. Because of you, he stay here. They leave him. And now he was going away from me. So he don't make no trouble for you. A fine partner. So you're going to turn me over. You've got me wrong, Cherokee. All I want is that money to take back with me. I'm mighty glad to hear that, kid. You double-crossing. I didn't do this, Cherokee. And you've got to leave that. That's straight. What's the rest of your outfit? I'm no double-crosser. He doesn't know. He wasn't with him. Just on your way to join him. Well, they have a long time to wait for you. I tell you, he's through with them. That's why he was going away. You don't take him away. You don't take him away. You don't take him away. Don't go. That's all right, don't Chiquita. Go. I'll be back. Sure, he'll be back, Rosita. Oh, don't take her. You think I'm going to what to do? Well, I oh. guess Slade was right. Oh, don't go. You can't take him away. You can't go. You can't go. Oh. All right, sir. Come on. Oh. I can't answer the mouth. What to do? Ever do. Get out! Get out! Oh, wait a minute, Rosita. Wait a minute. Oh, me pardon. We'll get him out of this, all right. Oh, but we've got to think fast. Oh, If you please, mister, can I see Senor Cherokee? Oh, you're, you're, you're his g g g g girl, ain't you? Sure, sure, sorry, but I, I, I got orders not to. Oh, but I must see him. You, 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 you better c c come back a after I ask Hank. But you will give him this. Oh. Sure. Oh, gracias, senor. Gracias. <laughs> good, 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 good gracious to you, sis, senorita. Gracias, senor. Why didn't you let me see her? I, 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 I gotta ask Hank. Hey, hey. You're... Your, your, your girl b b b brought you this. But it's a shame to, to waste it on you. you. You wouldn't know how it smells tomorrow. Go away from here, I'll wring your neck. Don't, 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 don't you get stuck with me. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll shoot you.
Hmm. Chicken. I'd go for one of those lakes myself. Hmm. That's good. Where'd you get it? It's girl, but brought it. He and your girl bought this chicken for you. I don't want it. Oh, you don't want to disappoint her, do you? You better eat it. All right. I know it'll be good if Rosita... Everything is all right. Don't let him see you here, Odita. Come on. Your horse will be ready in about five minutes. Well, hurry it up. I gotta get going. I was coming over and see you as soon as I got my horse. What's the matter? Why, nothing but. Surprised to see you, that's all. Come here, Hank. Sure, he got away. Get into that jail, Tex, and see what happened to the guard. All right. And how do you suppose he got out? Why don't you ask the Nevada kid? What do you mean, Miss Jolan? I saw him bring the horse that man escaped on. Well, I guess that cooks your goose, kid. You'll fit the necktie we picked for your partner. And our partner ain't going to save you. All right, lock him up. Come on. I figured I'd catch up with you fellas. You're a little late about it, Cherokee. They slapped me in jail for what you did, Slade. The kid framed it, and I got away. Rosita tells me they've got the kid. And they're hanging him in my place. Well? You don't think I'd let them do it? Meaning? That I'm taking the express company's gold back. All of it. Now, don't get excited, Cherokee. I'm not. Just careful. You don't think we'd let that kid hang, do you? But how do we know you're on the square with us? You might ride along a ways and find out. Thanks. I will.
Throw that gun down. You made a bad guess, road agent. I'm not carrying anything in this trip that you want. You're carrying a couple of us back. And that express company's gold you've been missing. Bring it here, Jip. Keep your eyes straight ahead and don't drive like you're going to a funeral. Or it'll be yours. That's right, Cherokee. If you don't get there, it's liable to be somebody's funeral. We wait on the yeah, we're yeah, we want him. Now, wait a minute. You can't have him. He's my prisoner, and I'm taking him to Carson City with me. If Jerry, he doesn't get back. But he will come back. Rosita, she knows. Ah, oh, who would believe her? She's one of them. You better turn him over to us. Hey. Pull out. Yeah, yeah, bring him out. As long as I'm around this star, you're not taking him. You'll save yourself a lot of trouble if you take you that star out. stop us, and you know it. Not, not a chance. No, 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 no. Maybe you're right. I'll think it over. Then think fast. Bad. That when you got a new deal, kid, you didn't play your cards right. There's always a joker in the deck, isn't there, Hank? This time your fellow citizens are going to dwell it. When you don't show up for a part of the holding out there for you, I'm going to slip you out and take you to Carson City. Right now. And you've got to stick with me. Before you go, I want you to know that I'm sorry. That I had so much faith in you. That when you helped Cherokee get away, I felt that the others were right and that I'd been wrong. I realized afterward that he was your friend. And that he had the real faith in you. Come on. Well, you figure Hank's going to turn him over to us? We're not waiting to find out. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Come on, Bill. Come on. Don't worry, Joanne. Hey, my back, Hank. Can't get away with it. We're going to take you along, too, Hank, when we get through with this kid. Come on, get him out of here. Get going, you. You're going to strip some him. Come on. But you can't do this. It's murder. It's law, Miss Joanne, without the trimming. He only did for his friend what any one of you would. Chucky! Mi querido, mi querido, oh, mi querido, mi querido, what has happened to him? Oh. Knife in the back. Why, he wasn't any more dead than me when he and Slade got in. Cherokee said they were bringing back the express company's money. Here it is. Sam. You wanted a life for old man Miller's, didn't you? Well, you've got it without any trouble on your part. Now someone's got to answer for Cherokee. Give me a gun and I'll save you that trouble.
the matter with you? Are you nervous? You're in a sk fright, are you? Well, who wouldn't be? You did away with Cherokee, didn't you? Yeah, the squealer. And you left your kid in the jam, didn't you? And if you're smart, you'll still trail along with me. Because I ain't backward in getting what I want. Leave that alone. Take your hands off that. Put it down. You weren't in the coach when Cherokee and I came to the parting of the ways, were you? No. Cherokee got his in the back. Where do you want yours? Give me that. You don't think I'm going to split with you, do you? Oh, come on, Slade. We split 50-50. We split nothing. You're quitting, like the kid. You're heading for the end of a rope, Chip. Well, I'm quitting like the kid. But I ain't heading for the end of no rope. I'm going over the line, and I'm taking my share with me. What do you say? That's what I say. You're not going to let him get me, are you? You stay out of this, Jep. You knife Cherokee in the back, did you? Yeah. We split, eh? No. The stuff's going back with me. I'll be seeing you sometime, Jeff. Maybe when I'm honeymooning. So long. 